KCRA's television film collection is probably one of the most unique and, and most enriching sort of collections an institution like us can hold. This is the, is the visual record of a community for 35 years because that's about the length of time Channel 3 shot film before they went to videotape. This collection came to us through the generosity of the Kelly family and when it was donated to us, it was believed, and we still think this is true, it's the second largest, well, no, it is the largest film collection of local news film in the nation. And it comes unique because we have the ability, we have the right to lease rights to this film. And it's used over and over for documentaries and productions, as well as in the museum. It's used many times for exhibits where we need to know what's happening in a community at a certain time, because it's all organized by year and by special subjects. This can, for example, is just the footage limited to the attempt on Gerald Ford's life in Capitol Park done by one squeaky from. The film collection is organized in, in quite a few different ways, but uh, primarily it's in day reels, meaning the news each day that was in, in the can for that day is segregated and organized according to what's on that day. So the way to get to it is to know when something happened, and then you've got a, sub a way to go get to the subject. Another way the film is organized is their specials. They did a series of specials, KCRA is kind of famous for doing travel logs, for example, and they used to sell those travel logs to other stations that couldn't afford to do it. But there's lots of specials, uh, things on things that are important subjects, capital punishment, uh, floods, uh, fires, uh, issues of agriculture and drought, and uh, it just goes on and on and on. There's hundreds of those. Then there's another whole section that deals with just the commercials that they shot for the companies in and around Sacramento that were on the air. That's a collection we've hardly even begun to process. Now, all of this stuff put together is just an incredible cross-section of not just Sacramento, but the whole region. And it's, it's the most valuable collection in many ways that we have. And some of the stuff that's really critically used by people are things like SLA, Patty Hearst, student unrest in the 60s, um, pre uh, presidential uh, aspirations of Ronald Reagan, his term as governor. Uh, in fact, that matter, all the governors, um, the important people in the assembly like uh, Jesse Unruh and, and uh, Willie Brown and uh, Moscone and many others like that.